in my nature box, I had this big bone. And actually, I found it when I was walking in Tennessee years ago. It's the jawbone of a cow. And I just wanted to show you guys this bone because you can see the teeth. Now, animals are built for different things. These are kind of like flat teeth. They're not really that sharp because cows don't need really sharp teeth because why? Yeah, because they don't eat um, meat. Meat eaters need sharp um, triangle, sharp teeth to bite into meat and tear it apart. These are flat-ish type teeth because the cow only eats grasses and stuff and hay. All right. What do you think? I have this guy next. Also, I found it. What do you think? What do you think it is? Yeah, it's a turtle shell, right? It's actually the turtle's home. If he's feeling threatened, what's he going to do? Yeah, he's going to hide inside that shell. Um, kind of like the video I showed you guys last week on Dojo. I was showing my class the little turtle that I found. He wouldn't come out. He hid inside of his shell and actually could bring up his whole body and cover up completely when he's afraid. What else do I have? Oh, here's some things. We saw these at Thanksgiving time as Serval brought these in for my husband. What do you think? Yeah, he was able to get some um, antlers. These are antlers from a deer. If you ever go deer hunting, you've seen antlers before. And they are for, yeah, charging. If they feel threatened, they can use their antlers to charge, right? Okay, that's what that is. All right. Ooh. Now this animal is extinct, and this is not real, of course. These would be much bigger, but this is a good model of, of one. What do you think this is? Yeah, that's a T-Rex. He was a meat eater, so look, he definitely has those sharp teeth to eat that meat, right? So you can tell a lot about an animal by its different features, its body parts, right? And what kind of food they might eat. All right, so I hope you enjoyed our, our science lesson. I hope you get to get outside because it's a beautiful day. All right, take care and keep learning.